Heffron. Nine News reporter Scott Wegener is covering Northern Kentucky News Now. At Shania Huber's preliminary hearing, both sides knew there would be some explosive testimony. They weren't disappointed. Highland Heights Police Detective Bill Birkenauer shared frightening details from Huber's own statement to him as to why she allegedly shot her boyfriend, 29-year-old Ryan Poston, in the face before killing him. She said that he was vain. She also said that he wanted the nose job, so I shot him here and pointed at her face. She said she gave him the nose job that he wanted. The detective went on to describe what seemed to be a very calculated killing. First, shooting him in the face from the left side. What'd she do then? She shot him again in the head from across the table to the right side. So she walked to the other side? Yes. And shot him there? Then walked back. And what'd she do then? She then walked around the uh, side of the table to his left side and shot him more. It wasn't a surprise. It's their version. Our version will be different. Defense attorney Will Zevley is expected to claim the shooting was done in self-defense. That may be hard to do. As Birkenauer says, evidence shows Poston locked himself in the bedroom to get away from Huber's before the shooting started. Judge Karen Thomas eliminated the $5 million bond, ensuring Huber stays in jail until the grand jury makes its determination. Zevley says there's no question his client is staying put. She couldn't have made the last bond that was set, so it really doesn't make any difference if it's a million or a billion. She can't make it. Scott Wegener, 9 News, Newport.